uh, is very into Nerf guns, like I'm sure every other little boy his age is. But Hey y'all, it is Haley. Welcome back to my channel. I have got a birthday present haul for you. My baby, my McCoy, my six year old is turning seven. Um, he's a seven year old, will be a seven year old little boy. And I wanna show you what I got him for his birthday. I cannot believe he's gonna be seven y'all. Like he was just born yesterday. I cannot wrap my head around it. But I'm gonna show you what he asked for, kind of what we picked out, some surprises and some things that he asked for so he probably knows he's getting, um, and some things that uh, we'll see if he gets or not. But <laughs> uh, let's get right into this haul. First things first, he wanted tennis rackets. He's been asking for tennis rackets for months. I keep telling him, wait for your birthday, wait for your birthday, wait for your birthday. So I did end up getting him a Wilson tennis racket. I did a bunch of research. They had some at five below. Um, were they $5 or were they 10? Are things more expensive at five below than $5? Anyway, um, they didn't seem that great of quality. So I waited and I did get these from Amazon. Also, everything that is from Amazon that I show you today is gonna to be leaked in my Amazon storefront under boys, toys, games, and crafts. I'm gonna put it all in that um, kind of storefront on Amazon so you can check it out if you wanna get it for your little seven-year-old boy or girl. Um, the, his favorite color is blue, so this worked out perfect, and he loves blue and yellow for the Jackrabbits, South Dakota State University. That's our team. Um, but really, this was just the age range. This one is nine to 10 years old. He is, like I said, gonna be seven, but he's a big for a seven year old, and I know he'll grow into this very quickly, so um, I went ahead and got him a size up. Um, the other one was seven to eight. I actually thought I had gotten him the seven to eight one. Was it blue? I mean, do I shop or not? Well, this says seven to eight. Whatever, he's gonna love it. He's not gonna know that it's not for his age range. He'll be fine. Um, and I am noticing that it does say, y'all have to let me know if you have tennis kids because this is our first experience with tennis. Um, it says right here, Wilson Orange. And I did get him um, some tennis balls to go with it. Wilson tennis balls. Um, like I said, I'll link these below, but they're yellow. So maybe I got the wrong ones. I might should go back and look and find some orange ones. But it says all court prom tennis ball i don't know i guess you can never have enough tennis balls but i did get two of these because obviously he can't play tennis by himself <laughs> like who's he gonna hit it to so i have another little boy who is nine so i did buy the exact same racket um maybe that's why i got this nine to ten one anyway or maybe i got a seven to eight and i just opened up the nine to ten if i got the seven to eight i will link it below as well but i think i got the same one anyway ramble 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 he is getting a tennis racket and he is gonna be so excited about it. Okay, so I showed you the rackets. We have two. I showed you the tennis balls. Um, next up is Legos. He loves Legos. His brother likes Legos too and he is more apt to like hoard his Legos. He has a ton of them in the closet that he hasn't built yet because he doesn't want to like build them all and not have any to build. This little boy that's getting these sets, he will build these like the day he gets them. He loves Legos. He loves to build them right away. So I did get him this city set. It is called the Safari Off-Roader. It looks kind of like a Jeep Safari with zebra and it's got an animal, whatever this is, a mountain lion or whatever. He'll love this. That is so fun. So I got him that one. And then I think this one must be new because I have not seen this before. And we are a farming family. He is a little farm boy. So he is going to love this little tractor set, y'all. It's got a farmer and a little farm girl and some rabbits and, of course, the tractor. Um, so I did pick this one up for him, too. And these are just the right size. Like, those huge sets take forever. This we can do in less than an hour, and it's so much fun. And then he can play with it after. So he will love those two sets. So I got him those. Um... Both of my boys did get BB guns for Christmas. Um, if you follow us, you know we did Vlogmas, and that was the whole lead up to Vlogmas. Were they going to get the BB guns or not? They got them, um, and they love them. They love to shoot at targets um, that we have kind of um, up on a kind of a cardboard thing or a plywood thing that you stick the targets on, and they have um, little square like foam targets too that are like look like animals. Anyway. My husband had seen this and he said, Kaylee, you've got to get this for them. And it's the Daisy, uh, what is this called? It's going to be linked below um, in my Amazon storefront. Take pride, it's a Daisy, uh, What a rocket shot. So what you do is it's got this little target here that you shoot at. And if you hit it, the one little boy shoots at this and hits this. And then the can goes up in the air and then the other little boy shoots the can. So it's like a two-step thing and you have to like do it together and work together. One hits the target, the other hits the can. He said they will love this and I know that they will so I did pick this um 
Daisy, BB gun, Target situation up <laughs> for them, him, whatever. My other little boy's really getting a lot of presents out of this deal because he can play with that and he's getting a tennis racket. Obviously, if um, McCoy, the, the boy who is having the birthday, um, McCoy is his name, um, if he has a friend over or whatever, like he can let him play tennis with him or what, or whoever wants to use the tennis racket. But my other little boy is going to get a lot of use out of that too. Okay. Next up, um, I got some books. He loves to read. He's a great little reader. So we like to encourage that. Obviously these books had come up, um, I think maybe on an Amazon recommendation or on Facebook or something. I thought, Oh, how cute. I'd never heard of these. They're called the hideout kids. They look so fun. There is I think maybe 10 of them. So I just got the first three to see if he would like them. Honestly, the nine year old, my other little boy will probably love these as well. Um, they're just this little girl and this little boy and they go do all these wild west adventures. We love history. We love cowboys. We love anything Western. So I think he will really like this. So we got um, the first one in the series, which is called Tough Sadie and the Wild West. Um, I'll link these below. I got them off Amazon. Um, the next one is called General Muster. And the No Trees Town. This looks like a kind of a Davy Crockett character. He loves Davy Crockett, so I did get that. And then the last one I got was Grizzly Bears and Beaver Pelts. So I think these will be fun and have a little bit of history mixed in with it, which he loves. So I did pick him up these three, and if he likes them, I'll buy them all because um, we love good books in this house. All right. Speaking of books, I did get him the Oregon Trail set. We love everything Oregon Trail. Um, and my other little boy has the first set of these. I, I'm guessing it's the first set. I don't know if they're numbered or not, but we have a set of these already, but this is a different set. I think if I did my research right, there is only two sets of these. So this is the one um, that has Calamity in the Cold, Gold Rush, Alone in the Wild, and Wagon Trek. Wagon Trek. I do not know. Um, like what level reading this is, but he is, um, he's in like the third and fourth grade reading, le reading level. So I'm sure that this will be fine for him. It's, he is a, an amazing reader. It's his attention span that we struggle with. <laughs> so if he can get through one of these, we'll be doing good, but I know he'll love on um, this. Cause when, uh, my other little boy got his set. I think for his birthday last year, uh, he was so uh, jealous and wanted a set for his, for himself. So we got him that. Um, speaking of history and war, I did pick him up this little game. Um, those Oregon Trail books are in, um, Am my Amazon storefront, uh, in case you wanted to check those out. Um, this I did not get on Amazon. It is discontinued. I'm pretty sure I did have to find this off of eBay, but we have a lot of these. It's called Junior Ranger Land. It's kind of the brand. We have quite a few of these games and we have a puzzle and different things from this um, company. And they had uh, seen, you know how when you get games, they'll have like a little pamphlet that says, oh, buy these other games. And we were camping the other day and playing the Junior Ranger Land um, game. And they saw this and like, oh, mama, it's a war game. We have to have it. So of course I went right away on, um, eBay and got the game. I think it is, um, like considered used, but it, you can't even tell that it's used and this is the only way to buy it. So I did get that. I don't know how to play it or anything else. Um, it's just a bunch of little cards. So we will see. Um, I'm sure, make sure you subscribe to our channel and follow us. Cause I'm sure we'll be playing it at some point because they both, both of the boys wanted it, um, and asked for it. So, um, Koi's birthday just came along first. So he is going to get it and they will love this little game. We have, um, a couple more in this size too, this kind of little size and it's great for travel and it doesn't take up a ton of room and they have liked everyone we've gotten. So I highly recommend anything from this junior ranger land game. It says, um, players ages six plus and he is, I know I told you he's seven. He's in the first grade in case that matters, but he is a first grader. Um, and it says for two to four players. So we got that. Um, I showed you the Oregon Trail. A few, oh, I pulled this out of here. Let me put this back up. A few more books I got him. Um, I showed, uh, I think I showed maybe one of these in, um, a vlog the other day, but the other one did come in. So I thought I'd show you both of them again if I can find it. Oh, there goes the tennis balls. Anyway, it is the Graphic Library Collection. We have um, two of these already. We have the Alamo and we have the Pony Express one. And the, both the boys, like, if you can tell there's a theme, my boys are both interested in a lot of the same things. So that is kind of nice when you're gift giving. So you know that we're going to get a lot of good use out of all these things. But I did pick up Lewis and Clark. We love Lewis and Clark. Um, and then I did get the Gettysburg one too. And these are so neat. They're like comic books, um, but they're really great. Um, 
just reading books as well and the pictures are so good so they love to read these and just look at the pictures too um so i got him the lewis and clark and gettysburg so those will be a gift and then i did i think i showed y'all this before too there goes the tennis racket oh goodness anyway i'm trying to do this fast because they're out there playing they're told not to come inside but you know how kids are and now my battery's done let me just go ahead and change that hang on and we're back okay <laughs> I'm sorry y'all if you follow me you know this is pretty much par for the course so I did pick this um, up for him when we were shopping I went on a kind of a girl's trip to Omaha and I saw this and I actually got one for both boys but I don't know when I'll give my other boy his or not but I think he needs to go ahead and have this it's a wireless Bluetooth speaker his um, my parents are giving him a um, a blue not a Bluetooth what are those things called an mp3 player he is into music he loves music he loves listening to his music he loves dancing and anything with a rhythm he is all about it so um he had been wanting an mp3 player so that's what he's getting from them and i'm gonna link that below too she just got it off of amazon so i can um share that with you he's not getting it for a while yet till we see them later on in the month but that's what he's getting so I might just save this for that weekend and let her give it to him or put it with that gift or whatever, but he is going to love this to go along with his MP3 player. So it's just like super, I should tell you, I got this at Marshall's, um, $9.99 at Marshall's. Um, it's just got little sports all over. He's very into sports as well. Um, so I thought that this would be a cute little thing to go with his new MP3 player. So I did get him that. Um, what else? He uh, is very into Nerf guns, like I'm sure every other little boy his age is, but we have got so many Nerf guns, so I refuse to buy him anymore. His aunt is getting him one <laughs> for his birthday, but I am not. So I did see this um, on Amazon, and I thought that this would be a great way to like store bullets as well as use it as like a target. Let's see, this is probably a better picture. It's kind of like a hanging, almost looks like a laundry basket, um, and you hang it up on the wall, and it's like a target that you shoot your bullets into, and of course, whatever, no, whatever hole you get it in that's how many points you get and then you can store it collects all the bullets as well so i thought that was pretty cute i, I haven't been telling y'all prices on anything i think this was like 12.99 um the oregon troll books are kind of pricey they're like 18 um the daisy gun thing i think it was like 20 i'm not sure you're gonna have to look at <laughs> look them up the legos were around 15 to 20 each and the books were all about five ish five to seven dollars so um yeah sorry i wasn't very good at telling the prices on that stuff uh then i did just pick him actually it's kind of, it's kind of funny story i got these for my older son for his birthday in january and they came and my older son's favorite color is red and this little boy's favorite color is blue and they came and they were blue so i didn't dare give the red loving boy the blue gloves so i just saved these for um mccoy's birthday just baseball batting gloves so those are for him and now i'll have to find a pair of red ones because i never got my older boy any because we're just going to start um playing baseball here in a few weeks so i better get on that and try to find him some red gloves but i will give him the blue ones my youngest the blue ones for his birthday and then i did show this already in a vlog but i'll show you again um i had gotten this off of ebay as well it's called um walt disney's america um it's just a really old school uh disney book uh, somebody had shown it on um, Instagram and I fell in love with it right away. It is um, full of all sorts of Western cowboy stories, uh, Davy Crockett stories. Um, there is even a Bro Rabbit story, which we love Bro Rabbit. Um, yeah, here's the Bro Rabbit story. Um, so just a lot of little stories I think he's going to love. Um, so I just picked him up this book and he can read it or we can read it to him. I just, when I saw all the Western and Davy Crockett and the kind of, all the things that he loves, I think there's even a Ben Franklin story in here. I think if I remember right. So I just think he'll love this and it'll be kind of a keepsake that we can, um, look at and read together. So I did, <laughs> he's got a lot of books. <laughs> so I did get him that. And then the last thing I got, I'll have to get this open. Um, it is called a 3D nightlight and this is actually a gift from the older brother. It's the brother's gift and when it came in I showed it to him and he loved it so much he gave me some of his Christmas slash birthday money that he saved from his birthday to order him one too. I haven't given it to him because I want it to be a surprise for this little boy but he loved it so much he wanted one of his own so I did pick this up. I want, um, I think it's on now. Um, it, look, it has this little base to it here. This thing is so cool, y'all. It's going to be linked below. It's from Amazon. Um, this little wooden base, but I won't set that up. But it's um, it sits like this, and it lights up, and then it comes with the little uh, remote. And, of course, 
it changes, uh, I hope you can see this, but it, let me turn my light down so you can really get the full effect here. It changes colors as you turn the um, light. It, it comes with all these different color lights. And then you can make it uh, strobe in and out. Is that working? So it'll get dark and then go light again. And then you can make it fade. That's on the fade. And then what does this say? Smooth, I don't know what that is. And there's a flash and a, you can turn it on and off and all the different colors. Anyway, this is so stinking cool. I kind of want one for myself. Let me get my lighting back on here. It's just really neat just to sit beside your bed. And then of course you have the little remote Hopefully they won't lose the remote, but anyway, it's just really, really neat. And they're into, they're into everything. Let's put it that way. But they love space and the planets and all that kind of stuff too. So I think this will be really cool. Like I said, my nine-year-old loved it so much. He gave his own birthday and Christmas money that he had been saving up to get one for himself too. So that's how cool he thought it was. Um, I'll just turn it off and put it back in the box. It's, um, I charged it up so it would be ready to go. So when he opened it on his birthday, he would have that. But okay, y'all. That's what he's getting for his birthday from us. <laughs> I hope that he likes everything. He's pretty easy to shop for. Um, sports is a go-to, books are a go-to, anything Nerf, um, you know, the baseball gloves, that's sports, but, um, and then Legos, of course, and, and anything with his BB gun, he is good to go. So I hope you got some ideas for your little guys or little girls from this video. Be sure to subscribe down below because I'm going to be vlogging his birthday and showing you all the prep and, uh, all the food and all the, everything that we do for his party. He is having a president's theme party, so it should get interesting. <laughs> to really get creative here but it'll be fun so make sure you subscribe so you don't miss a thing and we will see you in the next one bye y'all